Howdy peeps, how's it going? I've been pretty lucky at my job recently. Uh, we've been uh, working a bit of overtime to make up for uh, the extra work at the uh, end of the year. And this is usually the busiest time of, of the year. But unfortunately for the past uh, couple of years we haven't had the benefit of that. For some reason our employer felt the need to be a little bit selfish and uh, hasn't really been giving us any overtime work at all. But uh, my boss has been going, go, been going pretty crazy about it. He's been uh, saying how much work we have to do and how much clipping I have to do. You know, and faster, faster, work faster. I don't mind it really, because um, it means just means extra money for me. And of course, any uh, overtime that you work, you get uh, like time and a half which is um, like you get your like a regular pay plus uh, half of what you pay what, what they would pay you on top of that so that adds, up, that adds up to quite a bit and I'm expecting or at least hoping to get maybe like an extra hundred or two hundred dollars on my paycheck maybe I don't know I haven't received uh, the paycheck yet I did work some overtime last Saturday and I'm gonna work overtime again this coming Saturday so it should be interesting to see what the results of that will be. Now, with the extra money, I've just sort of come down to, well, I have like three things that I would certainly like to see done with that kind of money. First of all being the Christmas presents, of course. With all the extra money, it should make uh, buying Christmas presents a lot easier. I have uh, four people that I'm buying Christmas presents for this year. Uh, my parents, mom and dad, my brother and of course Randa's and um, of those people I've already decided what to um, what to get for my dad and uh, I'm not sure what to get for mom or my brother and I have a general idea what to get for uh, Randa's so I know at least I know where, where to look for him so um, that's the, like one of the things I want to contribute the money to uh, the second thing would be um, of course, the traffic ticket, I uh, the, like that transit violation ticket I got, that was like for $173. I still have not received any official response by them about it, so I'm not exactly sure if uh, I'm going to be in court or when I'm going to be in court for it or, you, or even if they'll bother charging me for it. I don't know. I did send them a letter. I sent them the evidence of the fact that I paid for it but uh, or or didn't intentionally not stamp a ticket but uh, anyways I still have to wait a response and uh, given it that's a government thing it's usually very slow anyways so but um, I think one of the third things and I guess one I'm on the bottom of the list of that is the possibility that I might consider getting a Nintendo Wii um, it's been a long time since I've been in, in console gaming. I totally skipped past the previous generation, like the Xbox and the GameCube and the PlayStation 2. I just totally skipped over that generation of gaming. But I'm somewhat intrigued by the Wii. I think in part because it's obviously the cheaper system of the lot. It's uh, I was checking online at Future Shop. It was like $275. But, you know... It's kind of dicey because you have to get the system and then you have to get the game. That's like that'd be like three hundred dollars, uh, over three hundred dollars if you get the game. Plus the fact that uh, some of the games can't use the Wii controller. Like you have to get like probably have to get like an actual Wii game, and the new Wii controller is fairly unique and can't isn't really compatible with a lot of games. So. There was that issue. I, I probably would have to absolutely get a Wii game. But one of the great issues about, uh, great things about um, the new Wii system is the fact that you can get games from all sorts of other systems onto it. Like you can download older games from the internet, but you can play all the Nintendo GameCube games on it as well. So, you know, I got all those other games that I could be playing too. If I can't afford any of the the Wii games, I can still at least have that other library of games to fall back upon. And needless to say, the Wii is a lot cheaper than like 
new Xbox and Sony systems and I think it uses like a regular television as well so obviously that's a benefit too because I don't have an, I have an HDTV at all so um, the Wii controller has uh, rather some rather unique features to it uh, it looks a little bit strange because it looks like a remote control type thing but what it's able to do is it's able to detect the motion of the joystick and so if you like wave it around or wave it around in front of you like this or you chop down like that your character in the game will react in the same way uh... there is actually one game i can't remember its name that's all about that where you play as a samurai with the ability to shoot a gun and you have like the sword that you can use but apparently you also have some hand handheld thing which you use for shooting it's like and um, actually, what's also also cool about this new joystick is it also has a, sort of a rope uh, like inside of it that you can pull. You use a piece of like a tab that you grab hold of and pull this rope. And so what this does is it's used to sort of simulate, or I mean, it's meant to sort of simulate holding a bow. So like, so like if you're in Zelda or something, you're like. It's uh, like you can hold on to this like plastic knob and uh, let go. It's like you shoot an arrow out of your bow. And so that's, uh, I think that I, I saw that and that was like one of the features of it. So, but like I said, you know, they're going to include a regular controller. I don't think it'll be included with the, the main system, but you can buy like a regular controller because obviously you have to be able to play some of the regular games as well. And even some of the Wii games, I think, will insist upon it too because it's, it's still it's still a conventional method of gaming so at any rate um, I'm just going to end the blog here I, I might make another video as a bit another a video response tonight as well just for the hell of it um, so I will chat with you all later and I hope to uh, see you in December soon assuming I don't make another video before then so bye